Season 1 is now here in the first Descendant, and to celebrate the Invasion update, a new event, Descendants Daily Tasks, will be started. These devs are on fire, you're gonna love these rewards. Let's get into it. Directly from the devs, it says, Greetings, Descendants. To celebrate Season 1 Invasion Update, a new event, Descendants Daily Task, will be started. During the event period, finish your limited time and daily challenges to obtain rewards. So this starts on 829, day 1 of Season 1, right when this update goes live. As daily challenges are reset every day at midnight Pacific Standard Time, you can obtain your reward every day if you participate the mission after the reset period. The daily challenge rewards will be given via your mailbox. And I'll show you where that mailbox is and make sure they're there for you. Here's what they show as the daily challenge reward. The first challenge is to complete mission. So you gotta complete four regional missions regardless of difficulty. So you can do this on hard or normal mode and the reward will be one million in gold. One million in gold, that's huge. You also spend that very fast. Complete void intercept battle. So complete two void intercept battles regardless of difficulty. And then you're gonna get murky energy residue. That's important for catalyst. Macromolecule biogels, mixed energy residue, also catalyst. Advanced neural circuit, also catalyst. That might not sound exciting, but those are actually really good rewards. Complete one research, and you're gonna get a five hour experience boost of 30%. That's a big deal. We're going to talk about that more in a minute. So complete one infiltration operation regardless of difficulty. So those are the new ops that will be on rotation. You're going to get 100,000 Kuiper Shards. So big for new players. Okay, limited time challenges and rewards. So you can only obtain the reward for limited time challenges once. Limited time challenge rewards will be given via mailbox. Limited time challenges is obviously not a daily, but I don't know how often they're gonna implement this. They don't really say here. So complete void intercept battles, complete five void intercept battles regardless of difficulty. Wow, you're gonna get a crystallization catalyst blueprint and a million in gold. Oh, that's a big deal. You can go kill Dead Bride on easy mode and wham! Own Descendants. Own three or more Descendants. You're going to get two Crystallization Catalyst Blueprints and two million in gold. Now, I don't know if that's going to be retroactive or not. It says own three or more Descendants, but what if you already own all of your Descendants? Well, we'll check on that. Okay, complete hard difficulty mission. Complete 20 regional missions in hard difficulty. Okay, that's a lot of missions, I gotta say, but you're gonna get a three-day experience boost and three million in gold. I think that one's my favorite overall. Those experience boosts are huge for leveling characters. Now, it doesn't say whether it's gonna be character or weapon experience boosts or both. We'll see if we have more details on that in the mailbox. Okay, and the servers literally just went live. It's 4.04 a.m. on the Pacific Standard Time, and this is the pop-up you're gonna get. So let's check our mailbox and see if we get those rewards. So right here at the top, it says Descendants Daily Tasks Reward Mail. You've completed the event task, Descendant Daily Tasks. Please claim your reward. So I haven't done anything. Literally just logged in. They're just sitting here for me. Two catalysts and then two million in gold. Before I claim these, let's just take a look at this. So I'm just looking through this to see for a match. So it doesn't look like those were the daily challenges. Even though it says daily, I think it's this one here because it's two catalysts, crystallization catalyst blueprints and two million in gold. So I think that was retroactive. So that answers that question. So let's go ahead and acquire those. Communication inbox, nothing there. Lost and found, nothing there. Okay, let's test another one. We see here complete research and I'll get a five hour experience boost. This is off the daily challenge reward. So let's take a look at that. I'm listening. So it just says one. So I'll just complete one. Skip that, got a season level up. Let's see how, how fast that hits the mailbox. Pretty darn fast, there it is, one XP boost. So the catch to this is that I'm not seeing these notifications on daily challenge rewards anywhere in the actual game. It's only on Twitter. So I've posted this on my Twitter account and my address is down below. So be sure to follow me over there for the daily rewards. I'll continue to do that until I see otherwise, but I've gone everywhere and I don't see them. And I looked at the daily challenges related to the battle pass and they don't match up with the ones that they're rewarding us for as part of season one. So I'm gonna go back to this statement here. It says during the event period, 
finish your limited time and daily challenges to obtain the rewards so i think that even though they're limited time and daily challenges because overall they're a limited time event i don't think they have these notification systems in the game but i gotta say it would be nice if we saw this list of rewards in our inbox but they're just not there but they seem to be working okay so i did want to point out this comment from the first descendant interview that was just published so if descendant growth was faster wouldn't we see more diverse use of descendants as you originally envisioned and then their answer was we didn't run any in-game events during the preseason starting from season one we plan to boost growth externally through in-game events and we're also planning on an overall update to experience point efficiency that's separate and a bigger topic i think growth speed will probably pick up compared to preseason so i think these are the types of awards or events like double xp weekends and xp tokens like this that we'll see in the game how often i don't know but i think we're off to a good start here what do you guys think about these rewards love to see your comments down below Hello. lots to cover today catch you on the next one thank you for hanging out with me my name is tuxedo bandito that's tito bandito one and only and this was another episode of the first descendant if you found this video helpful subscribe like and turn on notifications to ensure you don't miss out on the fantastic experiences waiting for you in the first descendant and if you like videos like this, check out the one I have recommended for you right here. If you have anything you want to see covered, be sure to let me know in the comments below. And thank you to all the channel members and donors who make everything possible. Tux Nation wouldn't be without you. When you buy or download anything for the first descendant, be sure to use Tux's creator code to support the channel. Easy peasy. Follow me.